So as part of getting this from my from my desk surface to my upper shelf all put together I've got some things I gotta do before I can do that so let's set these new crystals aside over here for now and I've got this really cool orange guy and some really fun Montana glass a new piece of malachite I don't um, if anyone wants to chime in and does the hole in a hagstone have to be worn away by water or can it be made by the way it was formed and came out of the matrix when someone dug it out of the ground and my new watermelon tourmaline let's put the book away and oh I did not see that piece. Oh, that is wild. Okay, cool. Let's see. Now, I have... Let's pull the card. Pull the Mona Lisa deck out from underneath everything here. And put today's cards back in it. Okay. And... Tie it back up. Even there we go. That. Okay, come on. Put her stuff back with her. Go like this. Let's forget that. Go like that. First. So you go back up there. Okay, so this was a. Oh, there's another. There's two fun pieces. This is all probably. Oops, that goes over there. Man made sea glass. Oh, and another piece of Montana glass. This was a garden rock until. A week ago, I guess it was. Let's see. So I have ah, this piece that broke off. Okay, so this is some beach sand I got in a trade, and shells I got from the same trade. And some, and the specific thing I wanted in the trade was this wonderful piece of topaz. Wait, citron, excuse me. Citron, topaz on my birthstone. I needed some, um, bill plastic savers that numismatists use and they sent me these nickels wheat back pennies I always keep wheat back pennies that I find and a cinco centavos But, oh wait, what is it, oh, what is, 
19. Hmm. 1913. But this is, what is this? United. What's that? Philippines? Oh, I'm going to have to look this up. I don't... I do not remember where I got that. That's interesting. Another weedy. And I don't know, this is just a boat and some pyrites, fool's gold that I found. Rose rose quartz bits. And to fill the dish, and those are obvious, they're just pretty green marbles. I like them. I like marbles. You know, as a filler, oops, a sewing needle. Forget that's in there. This is just aquarium pebbles. And I use aquarium pebbles as filler for a lot of things. But since I've got all of this wonderful sea glass, I decided just a little bit ago that I would use the sea glass to see now this is this was oh, this is so thick I wonder what it was okay oh that's a fun color set that one aside with those anything else that's not that was a thick bottle. Not just your average piece of man-made sea glass. This would be fun to play with, maybe. I'll put some of these ones with different shape. Remnants somewhere else. Ooh, a rosy piece. Mm, another pink piece. Okay. That's another of that neat color. Yes. Hmm. So. In this, we have a um, place called Asian Market, and I assume that a lot of their stuff is overstocks, but they get super good deals on just a boatload of interesting things and stoneware dishes are part of what they get. And I needed to place to put some things on an altar quite a while ago and I bought that and let's just put these on the very top let's put these long ones kind of pokey-ish That. 
just put all of this C stuff here. And the pennies and the nickels. And this Philip, this. Filipinas. Right. I'm more my let's put that up there so I don't forget about it. I'll put the those. I don't know why I kept that. That got fuller than I imagined. We might end up using some of these other things in a different place. Rearranging things. Have a great day.